capping the formula, the better thing to tell you is to use the power reducing formula. How many of you remember the power reducing formula? No? Here, go ahead and it. And so I can, this is cosine, right? Yeah. So cosine squared of s is equal to 1 plus the cosine of 2x over 2. Yes? Those of you looking back in your notes, you can say, yeah, I remember that one, right? In most books, this formula, the power reducing formula, and the double angle formula are given as, I mean, the half angle formula are given as exactly the same thing because they're related. If you look one up, if I took the square root of both sides of this, I'd end up with that one. So instead of x, what do I have here? Oops. I have a 5x. So what did I do to the x here? I multiplied it times 2. So I'm going to do that to the 5x here. So for my cosine squared of 5x, that's going to be 1 plus the cosine of 2 times 5x divided by 2, which turns out, since I have to break it up into pieces, to be 1 half plus 1 half cosine of 10x. And so you would put in 1 half, 1 half, and 10 into each of the blanks. 